That's really the only thing I'm qualified to write about is myself. I make my living writing songs. You know, anything else would be fiction. The first thing I remember knowing. His family was blown west out of Oklahoma by the Dust Bowl Depression. In Oildale, California, they were outsiders, Okies. His father, proud, independent, steady as a rock. His sudden death threw a shadow over everything. I couldn't keep my mind at rest, Merle said. I'd hear the train whistle, grab my guitar, and off I'd go. All he found was trouble. Petty crimes, two-bit robberies, and a stretch in San Quentin. Merle swore he'd never lose his freedom again. One night, Johnny Cash came to sing for the inmates. And Merle understood that he could find his way with music. The honky tonks were filled with working folks, whiskey, and Saturday night. Merle didn't talk much, but when he sang, they stopped to listen. He started writing about his own life. The words were never fancy, but always true. He created a hard driving sound that topped the country charts. It had a clean beat and a clear message. that can haunt a man. When you're emotionally overcome, it's probably the only time you go deep enough to pull out the kind of things that are worthwhile. That's the way A restless man never finds what he's looking for in this world. But Merle has spent his life chasing the truth of what it's like to live in it. And singing about it for 50 years.